Hey, what's up guys? So, as you can tell by the title of this video, I used to at least try to be a TikToker, aka formerly known as Music Lear. There is reasoning behind this though. <coughs> <laughs> there is legitimate reasoning behind this though. Let me explain it to you before you make fun of me. A couple of years ago, I was on tour. And this is when Musical.ly was popping, like everyone loved Musical.ly stars. And I was pretty much the only YouTuber on the tour, so I was the most irrelevant. Or not, not the most irrelevant, but I was one of the least relevant because it was kind of like a Musical.ly tour and I was just thrown on it probably for diversity because I'm trans, I don't know. I didn't have the app Musical.ly, I didn't have it. And the kids were like, Sam, what are you doing? You need to make a Musical.ly. We will teach you how to make Musical.ly. And I was like, ugh. What, is there a crouton? There's a fucking crouton on my floor. Like, I had that last week. That's so gross. I clean my room frequently, I promise. That's so gross. Fuck. Is that a chicken wing? I'm just kidding, I'm not that fucking gross. The TikTokers taught me how to do TikTok. And I kept up with it for a while because I thought, hey, guys gotta do what a guy's gotta do. Maybe I'll get a million on TikTok. I did not. I didn't even surpass 50K. I didn't even surpass 25k. So a lot of these songs are copyright, so I'm either just gonna play a song in the background or I'll imitate the song if it really needs to be imitated because, you know, they were they were good songs. But yeah, I'm just gonna give you a warning. They are very disgusting. So this is the first one I posted. We were in the tour van. Sorry, the tour sprinter. There's a Mercedes sprinter, okay? You know, no one, no one was going bankrupt by doing that or anything, so. You should let me love you, let me be the one to give you everything you want and need. Oh, I hated it, I hated it, I remember that day too. So the caption of this one was, I made this in a bathroom, and I remember all these because every single day on tour, I had a mental breakdown and an anxiety attack. I was so physically sick because I attempted to put myself through this type of thing and you know like if you have anxiety you can't do that so i just remember being so sick and so anxious house who empty need a centerpiece 20 racks a table cut from ebony look at the worry in my face like i you can actually see it i don't know if it's just because like it's what was that anyways I don't know if it's just because it's me that I can notice it, but like there's just no emotion on my face. Like I look done with the day. And at the end, that smile was like, help me. I'm fucking sick as hell. Somebody just help me. Damn all these beautiful girls. They only wanna do your dirt. They'll have you suicidal, suicidal when they say it's oh. That was just bad. That was boring. That was the most boring thing that I've ever watched by myself. Again, I vividly remember this. This was at 6 a.m. in a hotel bathroom. I actually just got done being sick and then I was like, yup, I gotta fucking wake up and grind. And I wanna play it cool, yep. but I'm losing you. Mm -hmm. I'll buy you anything, yep. I'll buy you any mm -hmm. ring, and I'm in pieces, yep. baby fix. This one's actually kinda good, okay? I'm gonna give myself credit for this one. This one's kind of decent. Come on, let it go. Oh, oh, oh. Just let it be. I wish you guys could hear the real song of that one. It, it sounds good with the beat, not with my, mel my, my own singing. I was trying to be very hot in this. And it doesn't, like, it didn't work. Yeah, that was really fucking gross. So I'm pretty sure this was the last day of tour, and I was so excited. Oh my god. <sighs> that was so embarrassing. Fuck! At what point did I think it was okay to have a slow motion, like, tongue stick out? Like, let me try that right now. That was so gross. This one is just golden, because I thought I was so cool listening to g Easy. If I ever said I'm never scared, just know I mean it. If I ever said I fucked your bitch, just know I mean it. Yes. Yeah. Yup, I'm definitely fucking your bitch. Like, yeah. That's just, I'm sorry, but I am. If you didn't know it now, you might as well go tell her, like, hey, uh, hey I know. I know what you're doing. Or him.
Okay, this is the worst one. I'm gonna- this is the worst one. Catch me outside, how about that? And then I put on the pink hat, like Timmy Turner. I'm going to just be totally honest with you. This was, I think this was a playlist. And I woke up and I said, I have to film it musically because like, that's my new thing. I'm a music leader. And this was after I was given too many drugs and alcohol. Like I didn't, like it wasn't my, I didn't know. I didn't know it was drugged. So I had a horrible night and I woke up and that was my first motive was I need to film a fucking musically. I've been dead so long, you look like love to me. They look up to me. I got fake people showing fake love to me. And this one I had a fat lip because I tripped and fell face first on my living room floor at 2 a.m. Just for no reason. Baby, we were born with fire and gold in our eyes. Like, I wish that I could take those five seconds back of watching that. I'm a motherfucking star. Look at the paint on the car. Too much room, make the ride too hard. Tell a bitch, hop out, walk the boulevard. <laughs> Look at the paint on the car. That girl is a real crowd pleaser. Small world, all her friends know of me. Yeah, that was real original. Small world. Here comes Harry Potter. Again. Baby girl, I'm shown and somebody should have told you. I'm lying, I'm on a few, don't you worry. This oh, apparently I have like 30,000 followers. I didn't know that. I thought I only had like 20K. But anyways, I'm done embarrassing myself. If you guys want to go follow me on TikTok and go look at all those, because there's a lot more than I showed you. If you really want to have a good laugh, you can definitely go check them out. But yeah, anyways, thank you for watching my video. I appreciate it, as I always say. Sunday is a brand new LGBT, so if you're interested in that. Yeah, with all that being said, I will see you guys on Sunday with a brand new video. Thank you for watching. Leave me a huge, big thumbs down. And I'll see you guys next week. Okay, peace.